welcome to today's video. So today I'm here with Lucy and we are in LA right now. It's mad. I mean, I could lie to you and say it's beautiful weather, but it's really not it's raining. No, yeah. You can't even gray. see across the skyline. No, like, it's but it's disgusting. fine because we've had the most incredible few days here, haven't we? It's been amazing. And, oh my gosh. Yeah, no, it's been so great, but we thought we'd show you what we have in our carry-on. We love doing collabs when we're together, don't we? And yeah. this is going to be funny because we're very opposite on the ends of kind we're of... very sensible. Yes. And I'm very... Excessive. <laughs> excessive. But I feel like everything in my carry-on, apart from a couple of things, I actually will either use or I think I need to have for like a safety in the back of my mind, like just in case I need it. So what bag have you got with you? Okay, so I've got my massive River Island one. I got this in the River Island Active range, I think. It's basically the biggest bag I own. I needed a big bag and all my kind of like nicer bags are smaller. So I can chuck it about and it's like pretty sturdy. The first thing I have is this. I have loads of pouches. And I don't actually know what's in all of them. So the first things in this pouch is medicine. I feel like this is going to be a running the, uh, medicine theme. pouch. Yeah, I've got a medicine pouch. Okay, so right my bag here is my Louis Vuitton Neverfull in epi leather in the noir, so black. And this is generally what I used to travel with. I do want a backpack. We were discussing this earlier. Yeah, we I really do want a backpack to travel with just for ease because. Uh, if I'm fear. Exactly. And if I'm bringing my main camera with me that I'm filming on right now, I have to have it in my carry-on, which is, you know, my first thing, my camera bag, which takes up half the bag and it's so heavy. So I feel like I should kind of bring a backpack. It's better for your time. posture as well. Like, yeah. Like for your actual Oh, for sure. My stuff. shoulders are like that. Yeah, I would carry so on this shoulder. Because this is so heavy. It's always on my right shoulder, so I'm always like walking like this. Okay, so the next thing is another pouch, and in this pouch I have my headphones, my Bose headphones. Um, I have a little mulberry purse Full of with hair bands. hair bands in. I forgot what was in that. And I have a headphone splitter in case me and I want to watch a movie together on the plane. We're going to watch Sully on the way back. And I have a oh, what are they called? Invisible bubble. Invisible bubble. They are amazing. I have a charger. So next up, I actually have a pouch loose. Oh my goodness, uh, it's so matching. Yeah, but I like to be prepared. So this is from my uh, one of my Urban Decay palettes. But what I do, I have this ready to whip out with my liquids in, so I can literally just shove it through when they check my hand luggage. Is that one of the Sephora? Yeah. So I have a Sephora mm. under eye mask. I like to have face masks, but I just have an under eye one in there at the minute. I have a refreshing facial spray. I have an in Tent serum, like hydrating serum, because on the oh, plane you're scared. On the no, you Certainly need to try not. it. I have perfume, I have lip balm, I have under eye cream, I have bits and bobs, and things for me to play with as well if I get bored. That's like, what I did on the way. Yeah, I have like my Kiehl's uh, midnight, is it midnight? Yeah, midnight recovery concentrate. This is amazing. I have my Elizabeth Arden eight hour cream, and I have hand sanitizer. And then also in here, I have chewing gum, blotting paper and a sleeping mask, because these are amazing on planes. Okay, so the next thing I have is in a bag. Uh, it's Dreamtime Tea from Wittard, and it's got honey, apricot, and vanilla, and it's like really good for my tummy, so I've got a bit of a dodgy tummy at the moment, and it's got honey and stuff in it, so Just it's really soothing. good. Yeah, and it's quite, it's Dreamtime Tea, so it's actually supposed to be for like, before you go to sleep. Next up, I have another pouch. <laughs> we like pouch pouches. People. Yeah, so this is the pouch that came with the bag. If you buy Neverfull, you get a pouch with it, like after a certain, yeah, like they didn't used to do it, but they do now. Uh, so in here, I just have like period pads, a nail file, a pen. You always need a pen when you're traveling to fill in your landing card. See, so yeah, I didn't have one with me. Had to use that. I have uh, tampons, I have straws, I have eyelash glue. Uh, Oh, painkillers, lip balm, just anything you can need. This stays in my bag even when I'm not traveling. So this is just like one of them like essential packs. So yeah. I'm like, why would I take it out? Like there's yeah, no point. Well keep it in. Just keep just it in. Just in case. Yeah. Okay, so the next thing I have is again a medicine pouch. As you guys can probably tell, I don't actually, I'm not a pharmacist. I just have like a lot of like health issues at the moment, so I have multiple medicine pouches just in case. Next up, I have a pack of simple wipes. I feel like these are amazing on the plane to refresh yourself. And um, yeah, I just, when you're up in the air, like the first thing I like to do when I get on the plane is wash my face. And then before I get off the plane, I like to wash my face again and then put some like moisturizer on or something. These are so good. The next pouch is this one and it's from the Cambridge Satchel Company. And it's actually personal, personalized. Personalized. Per personalized. It's personalized, which is very cute. And it also has more tea in it. 
So this is the We Are Tea Soothe for Tummy Relief Tea, which has mint, ginger, and fennel. And then these ones are, what's the ones I use? The what, just like a uh, peppermint and yes. nettle. Peppermint and nettle They're tea. amazing. And it's literally so good. So I have a few of them, and I think that's all the tea I have in here. Can you tell I like tea? Next up, I have a handful of things. <laughs> so I have need a pouch my, for that. Yeah, I need a pouch for that. <laughs> So I have my boarding card from the way, I have my, uh, what's this, oh my landing card, I have a letter, I have my passport. Now, this isn't usually just floating around, so how I section off my bag is at one side I have my laptop, and then the other side of my laptop where there's like, just like the edge of the bag, I keep all my important documents, so I'll have like my landing card, and I'll have like my passport and things like that just behind my laptop so I can like grab them easily yeah. along with like my purse which is just like my card holder which is thrown in here somewhere which is just horrific I, like, I can't even find it next thing I have is a cardigan this is also mum's that I stole because it, it so is comfy. the comfiest thing it's <gasps> from... So I'm sure it's from the white company yeah it's from the white company and it's just basically like a massive khaki cardigan and it's like long and see if it's i feel like sometimes it's cold on planes yeah so like when it's cold it's easy to kind of like chuck on and just be a bit cozy or even like to use as like an extra pillow so i feel like sometimes the pillows yeah. aren't adequate enough that's why so. i always uh, travel with a scarf because it gets cold oh. you can use it as a blanket and a pillow. Um, pillow so i'm gonna take three things out first thing is this starbucks cup that basically i bought when i was here but i didn't want to put it in my big suitcase in case it got broken so I got that. I got a notepad and I have a deodorant. This is the most incredible deodorant and it's the secret pH balanced and shower fresh antiperspirant and it's like really creamy and like moisturizing underneath your arms and I love it. So Okay, next up I have a hairbrush. I never use this on planes, but I have it just in case. <laughs> so like say if you like I don't know, say if I'm so going necessary. like necessary. Yeah, you would say if someone's waiting for me at the airport or something and I like look gross. Then I like gotta look pretty. Yeah, not that anyone ever comes and waits me at the airport, but you know, I have this like fancy <laughs> in my head that like Danny Jones is gonna be waiting for me, and it yeah. like, never happens. Or, like you know, just in case. Just in case Danny Jones yeah. is at the airport. And and it's lovely the leopard print. Okay, the next thing I have is water wipes. Now the story behind these being in a bag is basically I got really annoyed on the way, and these are my favourite wipes by the way. So they're just water wipes. I tried to open it and I couldn't, so I just rip, ripped it open basically. So because they're open now, I can't seal them again, so I just put them in the bag. Okay, next up I have my headphones. These are my Bose in-ear headphones, and I have my iPhone connector in there also. These are amazing because I don't like over-ear headphones for planes, unlike Lucy, so because amazing. I feel like you can't, because these block out the sound anyway, yeah. but I feel like I can't fall asleep with over-ear headphones on because they hurt. And like they you? hurt my ears and like I can't lean on them, so I have in-ears so I can it's fall asleep. The only asleep. thing I have to say about that is, these go over my ears so they don't hurt. The ones, I've got quite big ears, so the ones that sit on your ears, I totally like agree. Yeah. I feel like they're so sore. And I couldn't even wear them like on a normal day. Like yeah. never mind like trying to get to sleep. Like literally just couldn't do it. The next thing I have, Emily was like, what shop were we in? Like Target oh, or something. It was some like little shop anyway. I went in and I was like, oh my god, have you? Yeah, it was 7 Eleven. She was like, oh my god, do you need these? Have you ever tried them? I was like, no, never tried them. And I got them and honestly, they're sugar free. Amazing. Because remember, you were checking. I was trying I, to see if there's any sugar because uh, Lucy goes mad on sugar. I'm like really sensitive to sugar and caffeine. like caffeine and all things like that. And I'll go like really, really, really hyper and then totally crash. So I was and like, we didn't want that. I was like snacking <laughs> on them and Emily looked at me like, I was like, just, give, just give it a check the back of the pack. She like took it right my hand. I was like, what are you doing? She's like checking the sugar. And then I was like, oh, but we didn't see. No. They are actually sugar free, which is why I didn't go crazy. They have berry so, ones as well that are amazing. What flavour are these? The watermelon ones and they're ice. I didn't even say what they were. Icebreaker sours and they're amazing. So I have tissues. On the way out here, I had a cold, which is miraculously gone. Which I miraculously have now. Thanks, Sophie. <laughs> uh, so yeah, I have two packs of tissues. These are just really handy on planes. Although, I don't like using my own tissues because then I don't have them anymore. So tip, when you get on the plane, go to the toilet and take a load of the tissues from the toilet. Not like toilet roll, but the actual tissues. And then pop them in the back of your chair and then just use the ones that are on the plane. Okay, so the next thing I have is my liquids. Now in here, I do have a pillow spray but I actually do like to put this on my face I don't know if that's good for you or not good for you but it's the Boots Botanics The Power of Plants Relaxing Lavender Body Space and Pillow Spray and this is just it smells like kind of like the quarterly one but I don't know it's more relaxing I think and I think the scent's a little bit stronger so when you spray it around you you can kind of really smell it so I have that in my liquids I also have a throat spray this is the Diflam spray if you have a sore throat you literally need this it's so good I've used it a few times 
because I've had like a little bit of a cough on and off, not very bad at all, but it's kind of like just totally got rid of it. I have the Ted Baker body spray. I got this in my stocking at Christmas and I got it in my bit. stocking Did too. You? Yeah. yeah, so I got it in my stocking and I thought, what a perfect size to put in my hand luggage. So, and then the last three things are lavender oil. Next thing I have is rest remedy spray. Now, this is amazing for anyone that has anxiety or gets a bit nervous on flights or any sort of like negative emotions, just like it really chills your heart. So it's not um, medicinal, I think it's just Herbal. Herbal, so it's really good to have. I mean, well, you do like lip balm and everything. Yeah, like that, you just spray it on your tongue. So I think I've got like pastels in here as well. So I have very little left in here. Like I said, I have my laptop, my I camera, don't. which I don't have in there at the minute. But I also have my USB cable nice. and my charger for my laptop. I have the new MacBook. So it doesn't have any of the USB slots, so I have to get like a converter as well. Annoying. I have a mirror because there's nothing worse than feeling like like what if you have a bogey or something like that and you don't know. <laughs> so I have a mirror. I feel like if you had a bogey, I'd tell you that you had a bogey. Yeah, but like what if you're travelling on your own and like you try looking in your phone, it just doesn't work. <laughs> and then I have my vlogging camera because I don't want to put this in my uh, case and what if I want to like vlog or take pictures and stuff. Yeah, that's true. And the final two things are a, another random lip balm and a, another lipstick. This is Velvet Teddy, my what one your friend. Name? That's me empty, Lou. Oh, it's not me empty. <laughs> so the next thing is this Dash water bottle, which I got one for Amy and one for Reese. And I didn't want to put that one. I think I put the other one in my bag. So if one gets smashed, then only one of them is going to have a present. But yeah, I have that. I have my Paris, which is just a DKMY one. My sister's got me for Christmas. I have my new sunglasses, which I got in the airport and they're Ralph Lauren ones and they just look like this. And I have another pouch which has my eye mask in it, which I was talking about. That's so cute. And it has the wallflower that I got. I have another pouch which I don't actually know what's in it. Oh, sunglasses. Well, they're nice. Cool. I think they're from Primark. The next thing is a t shirt, just in case I want to change my t shirt. <laughs> so that's what you do on planes. And the next thing is basically my favourite lip balm ever, and it's the Blistex Daily Lip Conditioner. I think it's like three pounds or something like that. I it's so good. And I have that. I love it. Oh my gosh, that brings back, brings back so many memories. I used, I used to, to use it in school. school. Yeah, yeah, I do. So yeah, I have this with me. And yeah, that's all I have. I have an empty pouch here just in case I need to like pouch up anything else. Might put my lip balm in that pouch. <laughs> <laughs> no, so you're probably, probably pouches. You're probably thinking like half that stuff's so unnecessary, but no joke. Lucy will ask for a cup of hot water and make tea on the plane. Yeah, I'm not kidding. Like, like I actually will. I did no. it like, what, four or five times? Yeah. And then at one point, because we're in premium economy, there's like a little bar that you can go up to yourself. And I literally, I was like rummaging around trying to find mugs and stuff. <laughs> I couldn't find one, so I just had to ask in the end. It was like 20 minutes later. But yeah, I make tea on the plane and I just But like, if you want to go for something a bit more limited, then. If you want something with all the essentials and more, then you can something use that I would say though is if you are going to do a Lucy, I would suggest having like a smaller suitcase that you can put up and then like have a like a smaller handbag. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, because Lucy was like... travelling with two bags anyway, she couldn't do that. But like, if you were going to go on like a long haul flight and yeah. take loads in your hand luggage, like, a smaller suitcase works really well because you can just get it down, open take it out up. the bit that you actually need. Because yeah. I found that on the way. Because I didn't want to put it up because I was by the window, so I didn't want to like move Emma out of the way every single time I wanted something for my bag. So I just stick it by my feet, but I just feel like it was annoying because I didn't know where everything was, so it was a bit of a rummage. But definitely, I feel like if I do that again, then I'll bring a smaller bag so I can just bring it down. But yeah. I feel like I did use all this stuff, except for like my sunglasses. And yeah, but Lucy, like this really doesn't need to be in your hand luggage. Okay, so I hope you enjoy seeing what's in our hand luggage. Obviously, they're very different, and the <laughs> sizes of the bags are very different. <laughs> Coming here in LA, and we actually came out for the Fifty Shades Darker premiere with Universal. I will link my vlog down below. Wasn't it insane? It was amazing. It was what, like... your vlog or the premiere? <laughs> <laughs> no, it was. It was so good, and we've had like the best time. Uh, but yeah, I really hope you enjoyed this video. We have filmed a video over on Lucy's channel about our higher makeup favorites, and see you very soon. Bye. Bye.